you, that could soon change. All right. All right, here we go. And Blue being one of And Redeemer, of course, already beat Blue in Winner's uh, Semis, so. Hopefully, they'll just remember that. Getting a bit of happy slaps in there. <laughs> they're just having a jab battle right there. Slapping each other. Occupied. All right. And now, of course, Blue being one of the members of the LOF crew, he's been doing it. Uh, he's really put himself out there as of the last couple months. As of the last, I'd say, quite a few months. He's been a solid member of Mainstay when it comes to these hand tourneys. At least around this area. All right. It's a down throw forward air combo. Mm -hmm. Oops. All right, so finally get some damage on him. Of course, the reason the reason Blue goes for back air so much is because um, that move got hugely buffed mm -hmm. in a uh, one one five in the sense that damage was increased on all parts of the on all parts of it. The hitbox size increased and landing lag decreased. Now, when you factor the fact that since the shield catch, uh, shield stun is largely, with certain exceptions, determined by the amount of damage that a move does. So all of that makes that move a lot safer. It's actually pretty safe if you space it perfectly to get the edge of the sweet spot. So, mm -hmm. yeah, Mario. Ha I don't know, not Mario. <laughs> Charizard has some surprisingly safe. Oh killing my moves. god, that, that was I've never seen. DI on D on yeah, the definitely bad. Part. Yeah, because that move. Uh, I believe Charizard's forward throw has actually like very. It's high base knockback and low knockback growth, so it really is Man. not a reliable kill option like that. I, so re I really hate to, you know, not be uh, not uh, be too in favor for Redeemer here. However, with well, the way he's been playing. And the fact of his, uh, how he can get emotionally sometimes in these matches, this could be looking very bad for him at this point. Especially just not in this one match with the set as a whole. True. But hey, he's got all the time to prove us wrong. That's his thing. Smash 4 is it's inconsistent, which frustrates a lot of people, but it does mean that you are never out of it. Mm -hmm. I know for a fact that like, when he gets hit by some kind of lame moves, he'll just straight up unplug the controller. Okay. Oh! Yeah, it just gets a flare blitz in the middle of the air, but okay. Throws the gyro funny. away. He actually he he went to go pull out a top, but he didn't realize he had it in his hand. You know what? I I buy it. Up All throw, right. gonna do it. The platform Retail. assist, just like a Charizard would. <laughs> nice little dash dance going true. on. That's true. Both characters. That is a dashu dance. Dashu dance. That's so true. That's so true because both characters really have the ability to capitalize off that top platform on Smashville. Ooh. Okay. Inching up. Okay, I like it. Use the fair to just kind of knock him off a bit. All right, that was super risky, right? Yeah. Well, that ain't super risky, but that was a. Now fair's pretty safe. It's just like it has. It doesn't have great range for what it does. It yeah, on the platform that'll kill. That was just <laughs> a kill. We are <laughs> we are looking at Ness. Looking right now. like Ness. All right, a four throw each time. That's definitely. You know what? Maybe Charizard was trained by Ness. I mean, uh, Trainer Red's not in this game anymore, but Ness has his hat. That is very true. Now, four throw each stock. You can tell Redeemer's feeling that one right now. Yeah, definitely. Blue's looking pretty happy about that win. Mm -hmm. It's hard to tell sometimes looking at that camera. <laughs> yeah, true. Yeah, not, ex not necessarily the greatest <laughs> resolution camera, but... I don't even say the camera. Just looking at Blue sometimes, it's just like... It's hard to tell, it's hard to tell with a lot of people in their tournament. Yeah, pe exactly. People's faces. Because like I feel like if you were watching me on stream, like there were multiple times during my match that I just like started laughing, and that's why, that's something that holds me back from being a top player. If something silly happens, I just start laughing at it, and that just distracts me. But people, fair enough. When it comes to people, and like just for oh like, no, Captain Song's my favorite. Aww. The Bubble Cap KK is good though. Alright. <laughs> All right, game two coming out here from uh, Mar from Redeemer mm -hmm. and Blue. Yeah. Also, shout out to Project M because they have an awesome remix of uh, um, KK Cruising uh, that done by Ben Briggs. It's awesome. I, if you if you mod your Wii U, nice. I put that song on. It's great. But oh, we're in, right there. We just saw Redeemer going for the Japanese combo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if you have, if you ever seen that, it's uh, like you drop you drop the top and then you go for the nair and then you just keep on chaining it like five times until <laughs> they get out percent. Makes sense. Right. Oh, I like it. The, Good uh, grab right there. All right, I guess the beat boop not gonna kill just yet, but next one could. Mm -hmm. Redeemer's gotta keep that fresh man. Land a few more moves before he's able to really. Absolutely. Ooh, the back air not gonna that. do it just yet. He's gotta be very careful, yeah, especially this high. close to the bassoon. No, he's he's landing high on blue right now. It looks like he's gotta start mixing it up a little bit. All right, landing with Nair there. Dash tech. 
Back throw will kill. And like I said, right there, back throw will kill. Got to watch your landings there. Every character has an inherent amount of landing lag. Um, so blue is smart there, even though like it, it obviously doesn't guarantee anything, but it obviously reduces the window that they have to avoid it. Maybe right, times right. it right when he lands. Ooh, but the up air is going to take him right out. He's right back in this. Good up air from Redeemer right there. Evening it out only on a 2% deficit. <laughs> and dead even now. Mm -hmm. Back and forward air there. Up air. I like that. It's a good anti-air option. When you're learning a character, learn your anti-air options. I don't know why so many characters in this game want to land on top of you. But I just it's such an easy... Learn your learn what options get rid of people doing that. If you're Mario, the only option you need is up spam. Exactly. <laughs> Palutana has up tilt. People forget that move exists, but it's good for that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Lou's playing very cautious right here. He's landing around the platforms. Kind of just waiting to put Redeemer in a bad situation like he is right now, but Redeemer gets back on stage. Okay, back air. Again, safe on shield when he spaces it perfectly. Ooh, another one. Okay, not yet. Alright. Yeah. Blue's hopping up, looking like he's, uh... I don't even know if he was trying to go for anything. He might just be conditioning Redeemer into a certain response. Oh, wow, nice nice right. connecting the beam from all the good, way there. Good long-range combo right there. Alright, gets up tilt. Alright. This All is right. the shield that kind gets of absorbed the gyro there. Grab hey, the big gets move. the up air. Gonna take blue out. Putting one point on the board for Redeemer. Mm -hmm. Ma maybe I spoke too soon. It's 1-1. All right, this answer question in the uh, chat, is Project M back? Uh, well, technically development has ceased, but we do have it on our Tuesday um, uh, Smash at the Lab stream. So, Yeah, it's currently Melee MPS. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. So it is there. It is back in the sense that we have it. All right. All right, so we got FD. Uh, okay, so... Alright, taking back the final destination. I'm not sure why Blue wanted to go to FD. He usually likes to go to, like, Battlefield, or maybe even Lilat, honestly, with Charizard. But now, believe, correct me if I'm mistaken, but didn't these two play each other in winter, in winter side? Oh my god! The gets, double stomp! Gets the double foot! Oh my god! Blue's going <laughs> off right now. Only at 24%. That move... I think Ganon... Ganon has the strongest down there, but I'm pretty sure that is the second strongest spike in this game, and that was just... Oh. Redeemer's gonna have the to make a faster resistance right there. He's gonna have to make a fast retaliation after that. Yeah. Looking at a 57%. Not too good for Redeemer right now after such a huge kill. Yeah. Oh wow, gets the jab jab grab. That's actually pretty tricky on Charizard. The timing's not ooh, not easy. I like the up B on the on the landing, because uh using the maximizing the super Oh my god, just goes for the raw oh, uh, flare blitz. Should have gone for forward smash in that for in that situation. True. Alright. At this point, you can tell Blue's feeling himself. He's just going for things like, like the flare blitz and just close exactly. it out. Even if he knows he just he's got to, he's got to calm down a bit. If he loses a stock because of that, then you can bet we're going to see the normal stuff mm -hmm. again. We definitely see a quick gyro setup or some kind of combo. In this. Mm -hmm. All right, Nair gyro. Okay, I like the option. The beam keeps him high, forces him to cover up. All right, flames. Yeah, Charizard's flamethrower is so much better than Bowser's. Because it doesn't have a flinchless hit hitbox. Alright. Oh, great! All right. Beautiful setup on the classic Good uh, the classic Rob Ledge trap. Good wait right there from Redeemer. Mm -hmm. Just dancing back and forth. Yeah, Blue's, Blue's only option was actually to wait. He had to wait for the top to come out, because uh, Redeemer had already committed to uh, going to the roll spot for the up smash. It's such a scary situation. No, it, it really is. Last thing it's easy to panic. Be, mm -hmm. But whenever you're in that situation, you just got to kind of take it slow. And, you know, think maybe your character has a back out option you can yep. use. But Blue will just use the down throw forward to take out uh, Redeemer right there. So he's going to go right. up 2-1. Of course, it's a best of five a loser's final set. So Redeemer on his uh, tournament game. But still a long ways to go. Definitely an honest tournament life right here. He's got to have to really consider this. And we might see a switch to Mario. He looks like he's thinking a lot about this match. Yeah. We'll see though. Wonder what stage he's gonna go to actually. Cause he, uh, it was town and city that he won on, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that low ceiling. So, but he cannot, of course, pick that again because of Dave's stupid rule. So, mm, not, uh, not, that's not any count for best of five sets though. I'm pretty sure it is still. No bands in best of five. No, no, I'm not talking about bands. I'm talking about DSR. Dave's stupid rule. Yeah. Oh. Redeemer can't go back to town oh, yeah, and city. I'm pretty so. sure it is. I see. I don't think that. Unless works. they gentleman it, but. I don't think that works for best of five. I could be, I could be wrong. I'm, I'm pretty sure DSR is what's in effect for best of five, and only DSR. 
if you get her, if it's like grand finals, you get the reset. You still uh, yeah. then uh, then well, it's obvious to reset. It, it works for lower bracket too. Like you can't go back to a stage you already yeah, won. Yeah, exactly. All right, cool. Up throw fair. I wish that combo had a name, but like it doesn't kill ever, so there's no point. I wouldn't want to have a name. <laughs> One's enough. Yeah. Keep it memorable, you know. Yeah, because I can't call anything the bow wow anymore. I'm just gonna call it the bow wow. It's what I wanted to call Bowser's up throw up here. <laughs> But yeah. then people said it on Where? the Koopa, and then I wanted to just do that for the read air dodge Bowser bomb, but now everyone calls it the chaos. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see people got Bow Wow from, like uh, Bowser, and it makes people like, go wow. But <laughs> Koopa makes so much more sense than it does, Bow but wow. it doesn't roll off the tongue at all. It's all right, like this is unrelated. All right. Anyway, uh, yeah. Redeemer's coming in with these beep boops here. Oh, uh, they're both dragons. Hey, look, is that wa is that Water Bowser? D no. <laughs> oh, is that Water Bowser over there? <laughs> it's like freaking very much flames. It's blue hot flames. Blue fire is, of course, hotter than red fire. My degree is in chemistry. I should know that. All right. <laughs> All right. All right. Good Catching Robo the Beam there. Redeemer has a lead right now. Yep. He yeah. just got He's got to go away. He's just got to not drown it out. Just goes for the grab punish there. Uh, this boop could do it, but he sent, got sent too high up. Uh, this kind of percent, really, just uh, spikes. And back there are some of the only few things that can kill him right yeah. now. Yeah. Actually, if he gets the platform under, an up throw could do it. Mm -hmm. Perhaps. With this amount Ooh, of range, I like the top. Mind the top. Oh, okay. Oh, he, he was waiting for that top, too. Yeah. Both players knew. And there we go. Up throw will do it. Good Aided up by throw. the platform. Redeemer taking first blood in this match. <gasps> oh, Beautiful! Oh, my Gets God. Robo side! I had and no Redeemer idea that happened. The... Redeemer yeah. popping off with that. Takes the up throw. Nice. But nice where did robos. it go? <laughs> where did the up throw go? Nobody knows. It went in town somewhere. Some some little villager is going to dig it Nobody up. Nobody <laughs> knows. They're just like in the creek in the town below. Oh, man. That's great. Brilliant robo side by, by Redeemer. I haven't seen that Reset. kill. I've never seen that kill here. That was a really great Reset option said he was Redeemer. digging in a tunnel all the way down in Smashville. <laughs> and... It, they just landed right back in that tunnel, and they just kept going. I didn't, they never I stopped. Didn't, I didn't know that robo side was a thing because I didn't know who died first with that. So, I, or maybe maybe it depends on the character size because Charizard's very large. He might die first just because his hurt box would go first in his head. The most unfortunate thing about that match was that only six viewers were watching live. Uh, hey, they they got the <laughs> they got the YouTube's youtubecom slash Bros Calamity. Right? Give it up for Redeemer. Oh, well done. That was job. beautiful. I have never seen that a robo side awareness. kill. That was wonderful. I'm not sure if it was... To answer someone's question in the chat, um, Blue, uh, he, he hasn't said explicitly that he mains Charizard, but Basically he says that he can't Charizard decide now. between Charizard and Mewtwo, but he's, he he's obviously has both of them. I mean, he made Mewtwo when Mewtwo was bad. Maybe he's just trying to like prove people wrong about Zard. So. And Changely Puff, too. Don't forget his puff. He does have a puff, but Apparently. we might never see that in tournament because she is objectively bad. <laughs> bad in all situations, basically. Yeah. And then... Okay in doubles, but pretty bad. <laughs> so, piggybacking off such a huge closing set... But this right. is one of Blue's. This is probably Blue's favorite stage with Charizard, though. Mm -hmm. So, Redeemer has all the momentum from last game. And here's the thing: right now. Redeemer can actually Robo side on this stage as well if we get Wispy to blow him. Oh, you've got. Yeah, that's, that's true. Actually, I'm not sure if that can happen. It it's, can. If if Wispy's blowing and they're on the ledge, it will happen. We'll see. That's a lot. That's much more situational. It is, but he has that option. But. That was you gotta be aware of what what options open up with different stages. So. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Like up throw is a great option here. Stage awareness is definitely one of those things I feel like is very underrated. Oh, I'm absolutely. Using. People say I'm just gonna go with just Smashville or whatever. Exactly. And a lot of gotta strike. Lot it's of like, hey, Lilat matter. tilts. Did you also know that the blast zones tilt with the stage? Like it's exactly. Stuff like that. But the back air is gonna take a uh, Redeemer looks out like right there. Redeemer uh, kind of kill himself with the air dodge. Yep. At the end there. Blue's so good at punishing air dodges. And you really have to be to be a top player. Like, people air dodge way too much. <laughs> yeah, well, he was in the blast zone and he air dodged. And had oh, his, okay. So, yeah, he wasn't able to move back. Yep, he's extended himself and killed himself like that. Exactly. Yeah, mind your, mind your hurt box expansion. Yep. All right. Ooh, all right. Wow, good. That was a really good wait on Blue's end because if he was he was too reckless and uh, upbeat early, he would have gotten spiked and died. You tell Redeemer really wants some kind of a some kind of hit right Ooh, now. great up smash to the platform. Only 31% on him. We are on tournament stock for both these players. Winner will face Vex in Grand Finals. That's right. Winner's taking Vex. At least we got a number, at least a number of three more sets. <gasps> Robo side! Holy I told you you could mother. do it! Oh. <laughs> no way! Blue one! What the? What determined that?
I legitimately don't know what determines that. Is it random? <sighs> no, it must. That uh, Redeemer was high off that last match right there. Oh, my God. And he did probably did not realize how the Robo side, how that is, it works much like, a, much like a Bowser side B or a Bowser bomb. Well, ba no, Bowser side, jump, Bowser always dies first. Yeah, you can jump out of it, though, at the end. Oh. So there you go. Mark, uh, so, like, Mar yeah. Like I wouldn't have known some that. Oh, my God. I feel bad first. for spreading false information saying that that was an Some option. characters just die first. Like, Bowser dies first if he's on his last stock. Yes. Right? But you know, Ga I don't think Ganon dies first. Ganon you, always dies last. Yes, but you actually can jump out of Ganon's side B also. So, and you can do the same thing with Bowser's at the very end. Like yeah, no, I know Bowser. I don't think you can out of Ganon's you can I'm pretty sure Ganon no, always You can lives. definitely not be. It's not, it doesn't always happen. And most characters die unless they have super long recoveries. Okay. But it is a thing that happens. That was, I that was a crazy way to end that set, though. Both set, both games in those last two, definitely yeah. worth rewatching. I would say. Oh Absolutely. My God. Yeah, check that out on YouTube.